back to another Zenotic casting video. Today we have Uncle Wolfie versus Champ over on Fuse. This is going to be a good one, so let's get straight into it. Both these two players, very well experienced, both very good players. Wolfie going to get a very fast frag straight off. And Wolfie's going to be trying to control this game from the middle for the first little section of it. Holding Champ, holding that uh, next ransom. Champ's going to get a bit of damage in while Wolfie goes over to pick up the Mega. And now Wolfie should be able to find the second frag just here. Beautiful shots there. Really crisp and clean shots all over from Wolfie managing to pick up that frag. He's now going to be looking to make it another one before Champ can manage to stack up. But he's going to get very low. 15 health just about makes it. I was worried he wasn't going to make it there. Champ's now low. Wolfie's going to take himself out with a rocket launcher. Respawn. Champ's going to grab that mega, arm, uh, mega health. Sorry. And now Wolfie's got to take a position to defend this one from. And a slap comes out from Wolfie. He takes it 3 to nil right now. Champ running straight into that grenade from Wolfie as he spams it through the bottom. It's an impressive... Impressive start from Wolfie. Champ, a very fast early game player, and Wolfie managing to match that and do better than Champ right now. Just up to two minutes, and we've already got four frags on the board from Wolfie. Five if you include the one that he lost. Six if you include the one that he did on himself. You can see... Very fast movement here from Wolfie. Just makes a little bit of a movement mistake there. Still able to grab that. Here's Champ coming through. Misses the next and eats a rocket straight in the face. Looks like Wolfie's trying to deny Champ the next here. Keeps going for it. And keeps taking that... Uh, keeps taking that weapon. Champ at the top there, Wolfie spots the top of his head. And now Champ's pushing behind Wolfie, trying to find him. Wolfie very low here. Champ's got that mega health. Wolfie does a bit of damage. Very nice. And Champ, big damage coming out from the Electro. Champ doesn't quite manage to connect. I was going to say Champ coming very quickly around the corner. But Wolfie interrupted me and interrupted Champ with that one. Nice shot there. Wolfie with... A very, very strong lead quite early into this game. Champ's looking looking to try and get back into it, but he's just taking a lot of damage from spam out of Wolfie. Wolfie very well controlling the map with a lot of spam here. And... It's a beautiful shot there from Wolfie. It's still really anyone's game. The speed that Champ plays this game at. It could be incredibly short. Between him taking back control. That he looks to do now as he finds his frag. He looks to take back control. But Champ is a very quick player. If he manages to get back control. It could be a matter of a minute or two. Before he's even in the lead. We've seen how fast Wolfie plays, but Champ is on a whole other level. Oh. 
but he's going to go down. He's not going to be able to take the control completely here. Halfway through this game, we are five minutes in. And Wolfie is still massively in control. I think Champ seems to have good knowledge of where the items are. As I say that, he's left a mega up. Fighting from the bottom here. It's a very nicely placed teleporter. Helps even the map out. No one can really take the high ground. It's a bit of a risk going through a teleporter, of course. But Wolfie, he's really, really good at prediction. Really good at spam. Really good at controlling where the map is played from. And how everything is set up it's a nice shot Chump not managing to connect with anything right now it's really not helping him out Wolfie hears him overhead now Wolfie is watching him he's not pushing in too hard And he's going to go down. He takes himself out there. But he's definitely trying to maintain this control. And here's what I was talking about a minute ago. Champ, a very fast player. Finding that respawn frag. Very quickly racking up on the scoreboard. A little bit of luck. But you need a certain type of play style to be able to take advantage of that respawn luck. And it is the Champ play style of choice. You see Wolfie just waiting at the back here. He knows he's got time. He knows he's got a bit of... He's got a little bit of score to play with. A little bit of extra control. And Chump's not got too much that he can do here. But he's going to find a frag on Wolfie anyway. I thought he was completely out of position there. And Wolfie holding up a trap. But Champ manages to just out-aim Wolfie at that position. And now Wolfie's on the back foot. Champ's got the upper ground. Champ's got the better position. Wolfie not going to be able to pick up the armour. Manages to get the mega health. Champ still with a very good position. A beautiful rocket predicting Wolfie perfectly. Leaving him with one health. And Champ is finding Wolfie at every turn. They're just running into each other. Champ does a good bit of damage to himself with that rocket to the wall. But manages to use it to his advantage. Using it to bounce off the wall. Go very quickly in the other direction. And get out of there. Again, we see good prediction from Wolfie. Champ pushing through these spots just in the break. We've got a minute and a half left to go. Ten frags that Champ needs to make up right now. Wolfie looks to be going on an absolute rampage. They're going to trade out each other. And now Champ should be able to find this frag. Wolfie going to kill himself and Champ going to return the favour. So that mutual frag a minute ago goes back down the other way for both players here. A minute left on the scoreboard. Champ does still have a chance in this. Four frags needed. It is possible if Wolfie panics and rushes in a bit too hard. Champ's going to find one. Can he do it? We've got 40 seconds left. Wolfie doesn't want it to happen. So he's going to try and play in a controlled way. But we'd only need to see two frags and an unlucky spawn. And there's one frag. Respawn. He can only delay it for a couple of seconds before he's got to go back into the battle here, Wolfie. Two frags and 20 seconds. Champ finds him going up the stairs. Manages to find the frag. One frag. We've got 10 seconds left. It's definitely doable. We've seen worse happen. 
Champ in the right position. Wolfie just wants to push in, manages to find the frag in the last second and gets the GG right at the end there. That was a very close game. It could have gone either way right at the end. Wolfie took a very nice bit of control, but Champ managed to pull it back and almost win it right at the end. Thank you very much for watching. Please send me your demos. I'm MX Craven on the IRC. Just ask around for me and you'll find me if I don't come up under that username. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next demo.